crack the crypto code. How to mine Tau on Bittensor. If you're curious about mining Tau on the Bittensor network, you're in the right place. Mining Tau is quite different from traditional cryptocurrency mining, so let's break it down step by step. First, you need to understand what Bittensor is. It's a decentralized network that focuses on building and deploying machine learning models using blockchain technology. To mine Tau, you'll be contributing to this network by running a node that participates in AI processes. Setting up your hardware. You'll need a computer with decent processing power as AI tasks can be computationally intensive. You can either use your own hardware or rent a server, which is a great option if you don't want to invest in expensive equipment. Renting a server from providers like DatabaseMart or RunPod can be cost-effective and doesn't require any space or electricity on your end. Choosing your role. On the Bittensor network, you can either be a miner or a validator. Miners do the actual work of processing AI tasks, while validators ensure that the miners are following the consensus rules. Each role is crucial for the network's operation. Registering your node. Before you start mining, you need to register your node on the network. This involves creating a wallet and a cold key. Use the BTCLI new cold key command to set up your wallet and make sure to note down the memnemonic keys for recovery. You'll also need to specify a password for your wallet. Running your miner. To start mining, you'll need to run the miner script. This can be done locally on your computer or on a rented cloud server. The script will include details like the name of your miner, the subnet you're joining, and the logging settings. For example, you might use a command like pm2 start dash dot bittensource 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 neuron slash advanced server slash main dot pi name miner 01 time ter interpreter python 3 logging dot debug subtensor dot network nakamoto neuron dot restart true neuron dot model name distal gpt2 axon dot port 891 Wallet.name my cold key. Wallet.hotkey my hotkey one. Joining a subnet, Bittensor has various subnets, each requiring different types of expertise and hardware. For instance, the storage subnet needs high bandwidth and storage capacity, while the AI subnets require strong AI knowledge. Choose a subnet that matches your capabilities and interests. Paying the registration fee. To join a subnet, you'll need to pay a registration fee which can range from 0.1 tau to 10 tau, depending on the competition within your subnet. This fee is necessary to secure your place in the network. Optimizing your miner. Once you're mining, the key to success is optimization. You need to ensure your machine is powerful enough to handle the tasks efficiently. You can modify the base miner code to add your own special features, which can help you earn more tau. Regularly monitor your miner's performance and adjust as necessary to maximize your rewards. Earning rewards, Bittensor rewards miners and validators with TAO tokens. Each block grants one TAO, which is shared equally between miners and validators. The network produces 7,200 TAO tokens daily, and this amount will decrease over time. The more valuable your contributions to the network, the more TAO you'll earn. By following these steps, you can start mining TAO and contribute to the innovative world of decentralized machine learning on the Bittensore network.